Patrick. And I'm Joseph. And welcome to Winners and Reviews for March 16th, 2009. We have a jubilee of stories for you today. We're going to talk about Resident Evil The Dark Side Chronicles. Nymph. And answer your fan mail. Hot news. Capcom has been busy announcing things this week. They have recently announced a Resident Evil Classics line of games, which are old games remade with Wii controls. Great. Upcoming games! Capcom has also just announced Resident Evil The Dark Side Chronicles, which is a sequel to The Umbrella Chronicles. Dark Side Chronicles is based on Resident Evil 2 and will feature characters such as Leon S. Kennedy and Claire Redfield. The game will be on rails, as was its predecessor, and will feature two-player co-op. IGN said that the game is roughly 35% through its development cycle, and so hopefully it will be out before the end of this year. Dumb people. NIMF, or National Institute for Media and the Family, are very disappointed with Nintendo for letting the game Mad World out on their console. They said that the console is no longer family friendly with this violent video game release. They went on to state, the National Institute on Media and the Family hopes that Nintendo does not lose sight of its initial audience and continues to offer quality, family-friendly games. We here at Wii News and Reviews hope there are more quality, mature-rated games because there just aren't enough on the system yet. Fan mail. Pulling out some fan mail this week, Rocky Balboa 69 asked. Hey guys, I'm about to purchase Mario Power Tennis, but I don't know which version I should get, the GameCube or Wii version. Which version would you recommend and why? We recommend the GameCube version because of the inaccurate readings that the motion control sometimes gives you. Sometimes you swing the remote, and it doesn't even register. GameCube controller wins this round. News and Reviews Pulling out some more fan mail this week, one of our viewers named Zach asked, Hi, Patrick and Joseph. I was wondering, if Capcom can make a Wii version of Dead Rising, why can't they make a Wii version of Dead Rising 2 when it comes out? Well, the short answer is because it's the Wii. The long answer is because the games use different game engines, so while Dead Rising 2 engine may work on 360, PS3, and PC, it doesn't work on the Wii because it just doesn't fit the Wii's tech. And while they also have Dead Rising Chop to You Drop, maybe some of the things they're doing in Dead Rising 2 doesn't work on the engine Engine for Dead Rising Chop to You Drop. News and Reviews And other fan mail, another random viewer asked, Hey, does anyone on your end know anything about the Zelda movie? I heard it was fake, but still, you never know. We haven't heard any rumors of a Nintendo-sanctioned movie, but there is a pretty good-looking amateur movie that's out, you can check it out by going to theheroeoftime.com. News and reviews. And finally, fan mail from Yvonne. Hey, Patter Joe, my friend Caleb is saying that he doesn't pay his Wii Live thing, playing with people all over the world, and I am saying it's not possible because you have to pay only for Wii points, but he is saying that playing online with people all over the world is totally free. Please make a video to correct him so I can win a 20 bucks bet. Your number one black guy fan, Ivan. You're both right. Uh, playing online is totally free. You use Wii points to purchase things via the Wii Shop channel. You owe each other 20 bucks. Paying Monopoly money. What do you think? Here's what you guys thought about Dead Space Extraction. You know, I'm about to rent this before I buy it. But, I mean, it looks like a solid title. It looks like it's going to do well. Hopefully it sells well. That way more games like this continue to be made on the Wii. It's going to be totally awesome! Despite many of you being skeptical, we think it looks pretty BA, and we're going to be sure to pick it up on launch day. Update. Skater Colin has pointed out to us that there are plenty of zombies 
in Dead Rising chopped you drop on the harder or normal difficulties. The clip you guys saw was from an easy difficulty. This is definitely true and expect more zombies on the harder difficulties. News and reviews. Thanks for watching this episode of We News and Reviews. Remember to tune in in two weeks for our another episode. Unless, of course, the FEMA trains come and pick us up and take us to the NWO labor camps. Thanks, and have a great day. Why am I naked? <laughs>